Hi guys, welcome to another video. In today's video, we're going to discuss about how to transfer WhatsApp from iOS to Android iOS. Effectively managing WhatsApp data becomes crucial when transitioning between smartphone devices. Yes, while traditional techniques do facilitate the transferring of the WhatsApp data between similar type of devices to a certain extent, the process becomes more challenging and hard when switching between different type of devices. Well, guess what? Addressing this year, Wondershare's Dr. Phone is still there. WhatsApp transfer offers a solution to the challenges individuals encounter while attempting to migrate their WhatsApp data from an iOS device to another brand of smartphone. Part 1. Transfer WhatsApp from iOS to Android For the first task, you are asked to transfer WhatsApp from your iOS device to another Android device. The process with Dr. Foon WhatsApp transfer is essentially simple and seamless, which has been reviewed in the steps as follows. Step 1. Open WhatsApp transfer tool Launch Wondershare's Dr. Foon on your computer, followed by establishing a wired USB connection between iOS and Android devices with the computer. Once both devices are connected and detected, continue to the toolbox. WhatsApp Transfer Navigation Step 2 Proceed to Transfer WhatsApp Messages A new window opens where you have to select the Transfer WhatsApp Messages button while staying in the WhatsApp section on the left. Step 3 Set Source and Destination Devices on the following screen, you will have to set the source and the destination devices for this process. Continue with setting the iPhone as the source and Android as destination of this process. However, if the selection is different, you can use the flip button. Lead to the next screen by clicking the transfer button on the bottom right of the screen. Step 4. Backup previous data or continue. As the old data will be deleted, so please make sure if you want to backup, do backup. A prompt appears on the screen warning about the current WhatsApp data existing in the destination device. If the user wishes to back it up, as mentioned earlier, they can proceed with the backup option before transferring WhatsApp data. However, if you consider continuing with the transferring WhatsApp data, then simply select Continue. Step 5. Transfer WhatsApp from iOS to Android. The screen leads into displaying the progress of WhatsApp transfer between iOS and Android devices. If you wish to abort the process, click Cancel, however, let it complete if you want to get it done. After some time, the entire transfer process will be concluded and the message will be prompted on the screen. Part 2. Transfer WhatsApp from iOS to iOS The process of shifting WhatsApp data from an iOS device to another iOS device is doable and can be done with Wondershare's Dr. Phone WhatsApp transfer. While these features make the process as simple as one click solution. You can easily cover the entire process by following this guideline as shown below. Step 1. Start WhatsApp, transfer and set the source and destination. After launching the WhatsApp transfer tool, select the option of Transfer WhatsApp Messages. Continue to select Source and Destination Device for this process. Well, you need to put your old iPhone in the Source section and the new one in the Destination one. And please make sure that both iPhones are connected with your computer through a USB cable. To alter the sides, use the flip button in the center of the screen, if needed. Step 2. Initiate the transfer of WhatsApp data. As you click the transfer on the bottom of the screen, a pop-up will appear on the front. While it will be a warning about the deletion of the previous data of the destination device. So if you don't want to delete that, the platform will be offering the user a chance to do the backup of the existing WhatsApp data. If you wish to do that, please Click on the continue button. Otherwise, you can proceed. Step 3. View the progress of the WhatsApp transfer between iOS and iOS. The next screen shows the progress of the WhatsApp transfer between iOS and iOS devices. Step 4. Check the status of the transfer and include. When this process concluded, a prompt message will appear on the window. When it's completed, click OK to conclude the transferring of the WhatsApp data. However, if the process does not operate properly, an error will come in the display and you might have to click retry to repeat the process. By repeating the process, hopefully it will be done. Well, that's it for today's video. Please don't forget to like, subscribe and share. And don't forget to hit the icon button so you will be notified about all the new videos that we are uploading consistently on this YouTube channel. If you have any other question or you want certain videos on specific topics, please comment below. We will see you in the next video with some more information and have a great day. That's it for today.